Hi guys, this is Dr. Din at your service. So the topic of discussion today is can mind move matter? Are you the person whose mind is going to move matter? If you are, then you matter. Otherwise, you don't. Anything that happens outside of you, first of all, happens inside of you. And in the inside of your inside, there is a very important organ called your brain. You exist because your brain wants to exist. And everything that happens around you happens because it is your brain that is bringing it about. And yes, there is always a collection of brains that make things happen around them. But it all starts with one brain. All you need is one brain that, that can move matter. And so if your brain is that brain, then what I will tell you about will matter. One of the things that we need to know about your brain, the white and gray matter in your brain. One of the things that you need to know about it is that it arises from the same material that your skin arises from. And this happens when you are very, very, very tiny, like literally a few cells old. So the outermost layer of the embryo, when you're a little tiny embryo, is called the neuroectoderm. And that divides into your skin and your brain cells. So the only way for your brain, your internal consciousness, the only way it can recognize itself is by viewing itself through the eyes. Now, guys, your eyes are not just the windows to your soul. Your eyes are the only exposed part of your brain that faces outwards. Everything else is inside. So your eyes are a window into your own brain. All right? Uh, so your eyes, which is like a very important part of your brain, can view your reality at all stages of your experience in this life. So when your eyes can watch its skin, which is a part, which is just like a soulmate of the brain, when they look at, the, at themselves disintegrating through time, it knows at what point your body is going to pause. When your body pauses, which usually happens in your fourth or fifth decade of existence, like if you're genetically a little more advanced, uh, this pause might happen a little later. But at some point, your body is going to experience that pause, a slowing down and then a pause. So when the pause happens, what do you do? When the pause happens, it's like a signal from the cosmos to you, dear sir or madam, that it's time to exit the matrix of existence. But we love our lives. We have not only our own experiences to live, but also we have to understand and live other people's experiences too. And especially now that we live in a very connected world, we've come together as a whole. So we have, we, we want to live longer, but we also want to live longer with health and vitality and vigor, and creativity, and love, and joy, and everything that you are designed to experience. 
And I hope that all of this exists inside your brain because it, everything that you can ever want already exists inside you. That is one of the philosophies of can your mind move matter. Mm-hmm.